damn it! Really? They said they were gonna hop on. It's been nearly three oh, hours. Come on, what you know, the hell? Forget it. We forget it, Penny. Come on, you know shit happens. You know what I mean? It, it is what it is. So, what can you do, oh, right? Damn. Four hours? Four hours? All right, all right, I, I, I get it. You know, four hours. You know, but here, you know what? I got something to tell you. All right. Have you ever wanted to just play with your friends, but every time you ask them, they said maybe depends? So let me tell you my frustrations through this rant. Starting with my girl Debbie, now let's begin. It was a Saturday night, and I DM'd her snap, hoping she would be down for some art or maybe Minecraft. I was on two Red Bulls with energy to spare, but when I messaged her, dude, man, she wasn't even there. So I sent a couple more, along with some vids, with her only replying being, oh, I'm sorry, watching kids. I asked her if she could play, maybe after she was done. She said, yeah, I'll let you know, that sounds pretty fun. So I sat down and waited for the couple of hours, hoping she could play when I see her after. I messaged her again. To see See if she could play. She's like, oh, sorry, forgot going on a date. So I sat alone, just pretty much waiting around till I fell asleep on Discord, making snore sounds. Come on, really, Dads? Really? Uh, you know what? This is what I'm gonna say. You, oh, Daddy, you, you never really come on. You never really come on, oh, Daddy, you. You never come on Even when you say you will Our plans get cancelled still Oh Debbie you You never come on Even when you say you will Our plans get cancelled still So the next day I call my boy Dave He seemed to be down so I was happy to say He told me he'd be cool just to play some rust but when the time came, man, it seemed a bit lost. So I messaged him on Messenger to see what's up. He said, oh, sorry, dude, my Crohn's is acting up. So I just sat down and waited again. I'm looking through my phone while I'm playing some Gwent. As the time went past, man, I DM'd him twice. Hoping he was feeling better just to be concise. But when I messaged him, he didn't respond. Turned out he fell asleep when he was on the john. I made a call to him after to see if he was fine. He told me, yeah, dude, there's too much going on my mind. And so I went to Rust all by myself and got my base destroyed by a group of 12. I rage quit the game and uninstalled it too. I sent Dave a fucking text saying, dude, I just got screwed. Like, it's not your fault, man. Like, you know, it happened, but just, just listen, all right? You, oh, David, you. Every time you say we'll do, I'm stuck here waiting for you. Oh, David, you, you rarely come on. And when you say we'll do, I'm stuck here waiting for you. Oh, David, you, you rarely come on. And when you say we'll do, I'm stuck here waiting for you. So a month went by and it's the same results I'm really starting to feel like this is all my fault But what can I do man, the time zone sucks My friends from the NA, why well, live in Europe? So I've decided to make some new friends Hoping to replace my buddies when they not around then I DM the message for hours and days Hoping to find a stranger that likes the game My luck prevailed and I found a few They seem pretty cool and they down to game 2 so the next day, I was ready to ping To play some League of Legends or maybe even Elden Ring So I waited and waited for some more in chat But nobody ever responded after an hour had passed So let me share you my lesson when it comes to games As an adult gamer, you got nobody to blame Everyone is busy from time to time So if they respond late, dude, it's not a crime